So I'm going to be treating a patient with resilient hyaluronic acid. It's also called RHA. And I'm absolutely loving this product line because it's so natural in all cases. It never is visible, it never looks done, and it never shows through the skin. So you can get it quite superficial and not have to worry about seeing that blue tinge or any lumps or bumps that sometimes you can see with some of the other products that are available. And the nice thing about this product line is it comes in different formulations depending on the depth or the area that you're treating. So Redensity is great for superficial skin hydration. You can get it right, right at the top of the skin surface, the top layers of the skin. And it's perfect for vertical lip lines or even under eye hollows or anything really superficial. And it will just generally smooth and hydrate the skin. And then RH82 is actually one of my favorites. You can use this for superficial to medium depth wrinkles or lips. It looks very, very natural. So I've used this on myself for smile lines or around the mouth, marionette lines or lips that looks beautiful, even cheek. And then RHA3 is just a little bit bulkier. So it just gives you a little bit more definition. So to work for to place in deeper areas like the cheek or around the mouth or even the jawline, it works nice. And then RHA4 is actually, I think, the best for jawline because you can use it for chin enhancement. You can put it along the mandibular border um, and it really provides a lot of volume per product. So usually when I'm treating someone, I'll use a combination of products just depending on the area that I'm treating and also the depth of placement. But everyone loves it. It looks natural. You never get that overfilled cheek or overfilled lips that um, isn't always the most attractive thing. So 